I'm I'm if Rockman loses, he let me down. Because right now, I'm all Rockman. I know I, I was all Tyron Woodley too. So I was wrong. And I'm and right now I'm standing here wrong before. I'm standing right here, Rockman, bro. After what he said right there. I, I believe, I believe he's, I know, I real recognize real Rock Mom was looking familiar. It's bad for Jake. And welcome to the boxing culture, bruh. Not the show. Welcome to the boxing culture. Brother, the whole tattoos, change your Instagram name, Tommy Fumbles. I let my father down, bet 500,000. That ain't, that, that. that's not the boxing culture. How many followers you got? That's dead, bro. I still didn't believe in Jake Paul as an actor. Come to find out, Jake, when I saw Tyron Woodley out there, he looked like Ben Askren. <laughs> He got one. He got hit with one punch and froze up and everything. Chinny in a mug, getting slept. His last. I don't know how many fights. Fine, but this is if you don't know that this is different because Rockman got a hundred amateur boxing matches and he's only had one loss. If you don't know that this is different, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry for you. The only way. The only way you will have Jake Paul winning is because you believe in Jake Paul. It will be a spiritual connection. <laughs> I'm not lying. The only reason you'll have Jake Paul winning is because you have a you have a spiritual connection. He's your spirit animal. That is the only I love Jake Paul. That's the because the math doesn't make sense. It doesn't. The math doesn't make sense. You, you think he has the right hand of the gods because he slept Tyron Woodley, who was punchy, but slept Tyron Woodley, slept Ben Askren, Nate Robinson, and, and that YouTuber was taking his punches more than anybody else. I've been, when I, when I brought up Jake Paul, I said he's Butterbean. If Butterbean knocked out a lot of guys, so his, his tough man power was real. But when he fought a boxer, he got slapped. He fought old-ass Larry Holmes. Larry Holmes whipped his ass. <laughs> Larry Holmes was old. He, he had prostate issues. Larry Holmes, Larry Holmes oh, get collected Social Security. He had no wisdom teeth. All that rotted out. That dude had, that dude was in diapers. Look, Larry Holmes was so old that he was in diapers. With social security. That man had his, his he had carpet. He had carpet in his Cadillac. And beat the hell out of but a bink. <laughs> I seem uh better win it uh for the culture. Yeah, he better win it for the culture. He gotta win it for it. Look here, look here. Let me let me let me how seem loses, he doesn't belong in boxing. 100 percent 100 percent And I'm and I'm willing to say this, not prostate issue, but I'm willing to say this. Butterbean was better than Jake Paul. <laughs> Butterbean will find his ass in the octagon and everything. Butterbean was better than Jake Paul, bro. So if Butterbean could get whipped by Mitch, love you, boy. This Hulk Smash Edition, 100%. This, this is, come on, brother. Jake uh, minus 225, Rockman plus 180 odds just came out. Everybody, I'm about to go to BUSR right now. Hundred dollar bet. Bet accepted. I'm not. I'm not, brother. I'm. Uh, and then once the prop bet come, I'm gonna put money on the knockout. I 
I believe you, Shobi. <laughs> Rockman is Jr. is coming down from heavyweight so he could take those punches. He would have to be di well, he was just 224. So the fight is in a couple weeks. See, that's the problem. The problem is he was just 24, 224, and the fight is in a couple weeks. So he's more focused on losing weight than even training for the fight. See, that's how Leonard got Duran's ass. That no moss fight, everybody think that Leonard just start boxing like Leonard, and Duran couldn't catch him. Bruh, Duran was 190 pounds trying to get down to 147 in a month. He ain't trained or nothing. He was so exhausted. When that bell rang, man, Duran ain't have it. People don't think about what really happened in that Nomas fight. Duran was like, brother, I, I ain't got it. It ain't even you being so good. It's I, I, I can't. <laughs> I'm trying to get some energy i can't draw from anywhere roy jones with the weight roy jones yeah roy jones did that to himself roy jones moved up and tried to come back down and do yeah 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 absolutely but i'm saying that was the first fight and roy won the second fight any excuses tonight roy he caught roy because roy was over aggressive the second fight was no excuses tarver just caught his ass so that's different but i'm saying bruh Duran was Duran was drinking and eating at, in Panama City, chilling, getting a lap dance when he got a call from his manager saying, hey, you fighting Sugar in a rematch. She said, oh, word? When? He said, four weeks. R Roberto Duran kicked that girl off his lap and went and ran and tried to run to the gym and threw up. <laughs> I, I got to get to the gym. <laughs> that manager ain't even tell him he was negotiating. Duran was like, get off. He ran and knocked all his food over and stepped over chicken wings and shit and knocked beer off. The <laughs> he tried to get to the gym he was and threw up. They were like, you got to be 147 in four weeks. Why he take the fight? Because he's Duran. This isn't like back in the day isn't like now. <laughs> it was different. You didn't have to be undefeated and all that stuff okay let me let me let me let me tell you let me give you a prime example before i go let me give you an example of how back in the day isn't how it is now and i think i said this before but i'm gonna say it again all you need to do is look at the nba you want to know boy because of the mindset no 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 not watered down i ain't talking about that let me tell you what i mean when a guy get touched in the NBA, he flops, he falls, right? Fine. He gets the call, but he still lay out after he got the call. He hold his head. You look at the replay. You don't know where he got hit and what exactly hurts. You already got the call. Why are you still playing it up? And then he gets on the free throw line and play the rest of the game as if he was never. I just saw you look like you need to run to the emergency room. Not injured whatsoever. When I was coming up, the, the manhood, you don't show that another man hurts you. Even if you got hurt, you jumped up. Bam, boom, you jump back up in his face. You don't lay around and show that you're getting your ass whipped in competition. <laughs> I, saw, I saw Charles Barkley at the free throw line with his eye closed. And I'm not saying that's cool. I'm saying there's a difference in the mentality. If you look at that, if that's how manhood is now. You, you show that you're hurt. Where I'm from, you show that you're not hurt. Are you hurt or are you injured? If you're not injured, you can keep playing. I used to hear that all the time. So why did Durant fight? That's what we we're made of. 